Hi there, Fat Cap Chef here, and uh, today I'm going to show you how to do um, basically uh, chicken wings. I'm going to flavour them with a the barbecue sauce, but uh, this is just an easy, quick and easy way to cook them. Great snack, really easy to do. So uh, all I've got here is a foil line tray, uh, shiny side on the outside, some chicken wings, I've got a kilogram here, and then some salt and pepper. Uh, that's basically all I need to begin with. So there we go. Open her up. And the bin. Tray. These wings have actually been uh, chopped by the shop. So you've taken off the sort of little three thin end of the wing, which is always a good idea. It's got a mix of the main part and then the flat part. I'm just popping these into here. Reasonable order. Now, I'm going to add some seasoning, and the other thing I'm going to do is um, I've preheated my oven to about 180 degrees. Uh, what's that? I guess about like four, I think. And I'm going to add some water to this because effectively, what you're going to do, stop them drying out, is you're kind of poaching and steaming them at the same time. I'm going to do that for about 40 minutes uh, in that oven, and then I'm going to take them out and we're going to go on to the next stage. So there's that bit, just wash my hands, quick dry on the towel, then I'm just going to put a good old sprinkle of salt on. Okay, same with pepper, just basic seasoning. Yeah, you know, she gets well coated. Just like that. And under a cold tap. And I'm going to put enough water in not to cover them. So they're not covered, okay? About halfway up. And then I'm going to close them up, so two sides together. Hold it at the end. Fold it over, zip along the top, fold it over flat and tuck in the ends. It's now nicely sealed. That's going to go in the oven. We'll be back in about 45 minutes. Okay, so they've been in 45 minutes. Uh, now I'm going to, I've taken them out. Um, when you open it up, be careful because a lot of steam can come out of this here. It's burnt. I'm going to do that. Um, and then I've got a spoon and I'm just going to ease them off the sides and then the bottom, just make sure nothing's sticking. And then I'm going to take this, I'm going to create a little sort of spout at this end of the foil. And then I'm going to pour off the liquid that's in here. Use the spoon to hold in what's in there. I'll show you this, it's a sink here. We'll pour all of that liquid off as much so as we can. Here. Now, you can make your own barbecue sauce. It's a very easy recipe. I think I've got it on the site, actually. Uh, basically, four tablespoons of soft brown sugar, um, two tablespoons, sorry, two tablespoons of tomato sauce, um, two tablespoons of soy sauce, uh, some ginger if you've got it, don't worry about it if you haven't. Mix all that together, add one tablespoon of runny honey or maple syrup, and you'll have a lovely sauce. Or you can cheat and use a short bought one, which I've got here. In which case, we're just looking to coat all of the wings. And so I sprinkle it on, then just use either a pastry brush or a spoon. And one little tip here what I find is that these sauces are a little bit thick when they, you first get them. So, what I do is use the first first two or three uh, little uh, squashes on, boom, slop it out. And once you've got a gap at the top of the bottom, kind of right here, 
then I add some water to it and then give it a good shake and you get a much better consistency. So, what you've got to do then is get a teaspoon, if you haven't got a pastry brush, and just rub it over to make sure that all of these are properly covered. And then we're going to pop them back in the oven, turn the oven up to 210, um, and that's so it's pretty warm. And we're going to put it on 15 minutes, come back, just check. And what we want is the sauce to be going crispy on the outside of the chicken wings and all that flavour will have been beautifully absorbed. So I'll put them back in the oven and then we'll be back. Just a quick note, don't cover them up. When you put them back in the oven, you want them to be left open so that they will crisp up nicely. Okay, so uh, I checked them after 10 and these are now 15 and they are absolutely perfect. Get one out, bring it up here. You can see this is the way I like them with just a little bit of charring starting on the outside. The sauce has dried in, which would be great. They're going to be quite hot, so be careful with them, um, <clears throat> but they're fantastic. If you had a, a summer and you wanted to barbe them, then rather than actually put them in the back in the oven, you could barbecue these once you've put your sauce on, which would be delicious as well. And of course, you can eat them cold, so if you know you eat them all at once, just pop them into an airtight container in your fridge and they'll keep for a couple of days, no problem at all. They're delicious cold, or you could reheat them uh, in an oven for 10 minutes just to warm them through. Uh, so that is chicken wings. Of course, you don't have to put the barbecue sauce on either. You could just cook them off the same way uh, without putting the sauce on. You just have simple cooked chicken wings. If you want to learn more or see more, just subscribe to the channel. It's free. It just means you get more notifications when I next publish a video. See you soon.